Hello everyone, this is Moses from Zate Gardens. This is my uh, summer savory patch. Um, they use this a lot for zaatar mixes or uh, use it in a salad, which I did a video on prior, um, which is delicious, or they could pickle it like I've done here. Let me show you. This is just about 2% salt brine. Uh, this is about a quart. What well, it is a quart size jar. It's four cups. Um, just a couple lemons here and there. Slices of lemon. It's about half a lemon's worth. Uh, salt, water, and that's it. And thyme. Not thyme the zatar, but thyme like a week to, to a month. And it'll be ready to eat. You eat it with olive oil and bread and lebni and, or yogurt or zatar bread. But yeah, not many people do this anymore. Or I haven't seen it. But I make my own and I have plenty of zatar for it. This is an annual though, so in about June, middle of June, end of June, it'll be gone. All the bushes you see here. But yeah, pretty pretty delicious stuff actually. So it'll be ready in about two more weeks, this batch. I'm gonna make more. I have to I have to make more. But uh, if you guys haven't heard of it yet, um, pickled zatar basically. Uh, I'm also going to put in one of them a hot pepper or uh, some garlic. I've never done those before, usually just lemon. Lemon, salt, and water. And uh, oh, it's pretty delicious. So yeah, summer savory, so very easy to grow. Extremely easy to grow. You just keep cutting them back and it keeps growing. Cutting them back keeps growing. It's so thick that you can't even see the ground anymore. There's winter savory right over here. That's winter savory. That's a perennial. That'll stay all year, but this is bitter or more stronger tasting than the summer. So those that's probably better cooked and and or dried. This is better fresh or pickled. Probably winter savory you could pickle as well. All right, everyone. Have a nice day. Happy gardening. Bye.